Hey guys, my name's Seb and I'm the Associate Development Test Lead on Tom Clancy's Ghost Recon Wildlands. Now on behalf of the whole development team, we want to wish you a warm welcome to this closed beta. Today, we are extremely excited to share with you the game that we've been working on for more than four years now. Ghost Recon Wildlands is the very first military shooter set in a massive, dangerous and responsive open world that you can play entirely in four players co-op or in solo. During this closed beta, you'll be able to discover the very first hours of Ghost Recon Wildlands in the province of Itaqua, one of the 21 regions of our massive open world. At the same time, we are launching the Ghost Recon Network, the ultimate platform for all Ghost Recon players. Log in now to create your task force, compare your stats, or plan your upcoming game sessions. Please do not hesitate to join the community and share your best moments by using the following hashtag. A new version of the fan kit is also available if you want to decorate your channel with the GRW colors. For more information, join the dedicated closed beta portal and invite your friends. Thanks again for your great support, Ghosts. We couldn't do it without you guys. We'll see you in the field soon. Last week, a crude explosive detonated outside the U.S. Embassy in La Paz, Bolivia. Two Marine Embassy guards were injured in the blast. Two days later, a CIA asset in central Bolivia provided us with these images. Our analysts have identified the individual in the photo as DEA Special Agent Ricardo Ricky Sandoval, my friend. Sandoval has had spent the last six years investigating the local cocaine industry. Our understanding is that Sandoval was the intended target of the bombing. What the embassy bomb did not accomplish was completed up close and personal. Sandoval was captured, tortured, and killed. Then his body was dumped. We have yet to recover it. Our target, the group responsible for the embassy bombing and the death of Special Agent Sandoval, is the drug trafficking organization commonly known as the Santa Blanca Cartel. Yesterday, they were just narcos. Today, they're narco-terrorists. Initially, the Bolivian government resisted the Mexican cartel. They formed UNIDAD, a Bolivian special forces unit. It didn't go as planned. Thousands of bodies later, politicians, police officers, and journalists have become an endangered species. The Bolivian government has imploded on itself. With no other options, the new president made a deal with Santa Blanca. You stop killing our people, we'll look the other way. Since then, Santa Blanca has turned Bolivia into the nexus of the South American drug trade. With their friends in Mexico, they also have a clear pipeline to the U.S. and Canada. The only way to stop Santa Blanca for good is to completely dismantle them, piece by piece. The cartel is organized into four operations. Production, smuggling, security, and influence. At the top of it all is El Jefe de los Jefes, Boss of bosses, El Sueño.
agent they murdered. You knew him? He was a friend of mine. Sorry for your loss. I could say it comes with a job, but it doesn't get any easier. No, it doesn't. Guess you've been down here a while? I've been living as Karen Bowman, international aid worker, for just about five years. Means living rough, but as a cover, it gets me out and about. At least it comes with a chopper. How'd you get in country? A fluent business class from Manaus. Hey, I'm refreshed and ready for work, right? I just hitched rides from Barranco, Peru. How about you? I got on board a bus in Huey, Argentina, and drank all the way to Via Zone. Nobody wants to deal with a drunk on the bus. That explains why you smell like ass. I've heard rumors about you guys. I was a rookie field officer in Moscow when the coup went down. There was talk you were involved? Nah, it must have been someone else. We were never there. It's not every day you get to meet an urban legend in the flesh. Huh, you should tell that to my kid. Maybe he'd listen when I tell him to take the trash out. Is it hard being someone who doesn't officially exist? You tell me, Karen Bowman, international aid worker. I'm sure you've seen the horrible, fucked up shit humans are capable of when there are zero repercussions. But let me tell you right now, no matter how you compartmentalize how you Desensitize, you can't prepare for El Sueño. He's got a religious street that rates pretty close to delusional. He's taken vows of poverty, chastity. If he's not in it for the chocha or the money, he's in it for the power. This joint task force is CIA, DEA, and JSOC. I'm your resident spook for this ride. Welcome to Operation Kingslayer. Our briefing said there'd be a contingent of locals. The guitar is 26. They're a group of rebels who've been giving Unidad and Santa Blanca some resistance. We'll meet their leader, Pakatari, as soon as we touch down. Bolivians have a long history of hating us Yankees, but this time, let's hope the enemy of my enemy will be my friend. But don't turn your back on him. I'm not going to. Soldiers, this is the help you promised that Sandoval promised a single Yankee died So you send a handful of soldiers Hundreds of Bolivians have died from Santa Blanca's bullets. Where will my hundreds of soldiers come from? As Americans we aren't here remember these soldiers are the best covert ops team our country has to offer With their help you won't need hundreds of soldiers. Are you familiar with the word Huber Senora Bowman? Meet Pakatari, leader of the resistance group Kataris 26. We will be working with the rebels to destabilize Santa Blanca's organization. They've been fighting Santa Blanca and corrupt Bolivian officials for nearly six years now. We'll need to coordinate targets. There is no time for this. We have information on Amaru's whereabouts. Amaru? You found him? Amaru is one of the founders of the Kataris 26. More than that, her group is founded on his ideas. Without his theories of an agrarian proletariat, there would be no organized resistance against Santa Blanca and the corruption in our government. Amaru must be saved. If you were to assist my people, it would do much to earn my confidence. Where is he? We do not know exactly. We know he is in this province and that there is a Santa Blanca lieutenant who knows where he is. I'll put a call into the activity, see if they can dig more intel out of the airwaves. Start looking for that lieutenant and keep me informed of everything via sap phone. Good hunting. Saving Amaru is important to our cause, Yankee. Make sure you don't kill the Santa Blanca lieutenant before you get the chance to ask him questions.
Time to earn your pay, people. Put on your game faces. I tell you, I'm not too comfortable working with Pakatari and these rebels. Their kind of ideology always ends up with more bodies in the ground. What's your feeling on this op, Nomad? End of the day, this is a revenge mission. We need to focus and get this done quick before we get stuck between local politics and the firestorm of cartel bullets. First objective, track down that Santa Blanca lieutenant so we can find Amaru. Hooah. Get about the right robust Mr. Dufrich bust to you. Switch to suppressors. I have a quatch no. Don't want to spook the target. Switch to suppressors. Caramba, caramba! Ich glaube, da ist Kommentar behindert. Enemy down. <lacht> Und werden zusammengeführt, das ist ja Quatsch. Könnt ihr mir nachjoinen? Und wieso bin ich denn nicht drin?
That's a kill. What the fuck, man? That was a civilian. Gonna execute him because he hurt your feelings. We're clear on this side. Get that quieto. Here's the deal, asshole. You answer my questions, or I put a bullet in your gut and leave you to die in your own shit. No enciendes? Chill the fuck out, cabron. What do you want? Amaru, where can I find him? <laughs> you serious? That's what the. Pere total saldra bien. Here's the deal, asshole. You answer my questions, or I put a bullet in your gut and leave you to die in your own shit. No enciendes? Chill the fuck out, cabron. Target down. Good shooting. Let's clean up and move on. Clear. Good. We all in one piece? Bad guys in the area. We got a Sicario. There. In the watchtower. These guys! Down. They're gonna see you. <laughs> Quédate quieto. Here's the deal, asshole. You answer my questions, or I put a bullet in your gut and leave you to die in your own shit. No enciendes? Chill the fuck out, cabron. What do you want? Amaru, where can I find him? <laughs> you serious? That's what this is about? Sure thing. He's at Atoya Farm. Go on. Then you can see what we do to people who fuck with us. People like you. Need to get this done in a hurry. Amaru's an old man. He's not gonna last long under torture. Shit, if they've been working on him for a while, there's a good chance he's already dead. Hold up. Shit balls. Take cover! Okay, let's focus on the mission. Let's get moving. 
cartel isn't gonna wait around for us to track down and rescue Amaru. Senior rebel. We got Tango, stage or close. Civilians in the area. Watch your targets. I got a narco over here. The field. See?
Tango down. We got a Sicario. We got him. Inside the barn. Target down. There's a weapons case over here. That's it, we're clear. Are you Amaru? Come on, we're getting you out of here. Sure are a lot of lights and switches up here. You're taking me back to your friends. Entonces, Pacatari has made his deal with the malditos extranjeros, the young fool. Take it up with him, senor. Yo, I got a weapons case here. Go nice with my boots.
hurt? Santa Blanca is not the most gracious of hosts. These Aucas, these demons, they had questioning me. Let us say their talk of love was enough to make me vomit. But their methods were not... were not... Were their names Yuri and Polito? Si, Yuri Polito. These are the fucks that tortured Ricky Sandoval while Sueño questioned him. I want them bad. We only saw run-of-the-mill Sicarios when we freed Amaru. But I haven't seen Yuri Polito in at least three days, maybe four. I don't know where they are now. We need more intel. We'll search every village and camp until we find something. Somebody's gotta know something. Gather documents, hack computers, interrogate hostile lieutenants, talk to civvies, whatever it takes. We'll turn over every rock. Heads up. Bowman's file on Yuri and Plito is coming through. That's the rundown on La Yuri and El Polito. They're a key part of Santa Blanca's security operation. Remember to check out Bowman's briefing on their chain of command. <laughs>